Our only objective on today's Wheel of Mutt is to get a new quarterback. You know, I can't win every game, but I'm just so insanely frustrated with last game. You know, Throne had kept telling me, kept saying how important Gunslinger was, and I didn't believe him until I've been playing with this Aaron Rodgers. Last game was a close game. Played a God Squad. The guy sucked. But I just kept selling because I couldn't make the throw, like, easy throws because the ball was throwing so slow. By the way, EA, why do I need an ability to make my quarterback throw the ball at the speed that they should throw it? Fuck that. It's just dumb. Either way, I need the ability now. I'm like dead set on needing it. Unfortunately, this Rodgers doesn't get it unless he's a 95 overall. And um, if I'm not going to get Gunslinger, at least I want an escape artist QB. Someone I can run around with. I blame him solely for my loss. Also, that guy got lucky as shit. I take no responsibility at all. None. <laughs> Gee, why was open? But why was open? If you've ever typed that in your life, I just would like to know what it feels like to be a gigantic beta male. Who the fuck said that? Because I have no, I'm such a sigma, I'm such an alpha, I have no idea what it's like. So if you've ever typed that, please let me know. Maybe shoot me a DM or drop a comment. Just tell me what life is like as a gigantic beta male. Come on, baby. Save me. Say, I would take Lamar. I don't know if there's a good Kyler, but I would definitely take a good Kyler too. Swirl Spin's gonna save me. I'm telling you. Team Lily Jackpot. Yes! I think, I think, I think, I think. I don't know if there's a team of the week quarterback. That's escape artist. I think I might be ahead of myself here. Wait a minute. There's a Devontae Parker, Jason Pierre-Paul, Rob Gronkowski, Jamal Adams. Oh, there is a Patrick Mahomes. Jake Plummer? I don't want to use you. I don't know you. He is a plumber. He does lay putt. That's kind of sick. His name is Jake Plummer, bro. He's a scrambler quarterback. It's going to be hard to get me not to do that. He is the Mutt 22 team of the week hero. Jake Plummer, bud. Do you lay pipe? I mean, it's literally in your name. If you don't lay pipe, I would be obscenely shocked. He has to get escape artist. He's got 86 speed. No one is going to be ready to get sauced on by Jake Plummer. We got a team of the week backfield. Jonathan Taylor and Jake Plummer would love to lock our boy in. Winning a Super Bowl with a plumber would be so sick. The amount of pipe we'd lay, bro. It literally looks like escape artist might be the only good ability he gets. And ability wise, he actually throws the ball very well. 92, 95, 90 on the accuracies, 93 throw power, 95 on the run, 92 under pressure. Very solid. We got Jake Plummer, and I like that a lot better than Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers, you can be the backup now. You're backing up to the plumber. I love to see it. Our A, a 93 zero chill hero. So this is a jackpot is our next wheel spin. Who do we want? There is a Wyatt Teller, right guard. I think Wyatt Teller might be the move. There's a Melvin Ingram though. Ooh, Melvin Ingram. That's gotta be the move. Ooh, look at this. Melvin Ingram, 93 overall with 85 speed. It's kind of, it's not Montez Sweat speed, but it's pretty good. I think it's important though. Just because I got nobody there right now. All the upgrades I had made last episode were from those packs too. All right, Jake Plummer, you go re you're ready to go get us a win after that tough L? All right, that leaves us with our challenge wheel. We need four more wins. We are three and one after such a tough loss. That sucks. But hey, let's hop in. Our challenge is, uh Challenges outside kicks only. Calvin Johnson, Richard Sherman, Michael Vick. So it'll be Escape Artist QB versus Escape Artist QB. I'm surprised Plumber can't get Dashing Deadeye though. Escape Artist Dashing Deadeye would be, would be nice. All right, Plumber. Ooh, your first ever throw. It's laser, 17 yarder to none other than the most thrown two man in the universe. Um, ooh, no, 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 no. I don't know who invented that animation, but I hate them. Redemption games gotta be good here. So this is a tip too. Ooh, is that an offsides? It's an offsides that he left. Loser. I don't know why Darren Waller is my fucking receiver right there. He just left Darren Waller on an island. And we're gonna decline that. We had a free play anyway. Seven to zero, it's a pretty good way to start the game, but we have to onside kick. We have to onside kick. So this one should catch him off guard. I don't think we'll ever get him off guard again. I don't really know how you're supposed to onside kick. That's gonna go out of bounds, isn't it? I get that like, you don't wanna make onside kicks too powerful, but in the NFL, onside kicks almost never go out of bounds. It just doesn't happen. In my opinion, it's just a lazy, lazy fix for onside kicks. You're gonna go right here. 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 Damn it. Second and eight. He can't, oh, he broke a tackle. That was a potential sack. It was Davion Nix. That is my bronze D tackle. Third and 19. This is an excellent, excellent start to our redemption game, bro. I gotta pull up on this route. <laughs> Give me it. Oh, Devin White does get it. We just gotta stop and go. Vic got his ass. Got his ass! He might rage quit, bro. I kind of would. I'm going for two. So really, really good start. Definitely a time to go for two here. This is one of my fucking wheel spins. 
Ah! I forgot! Dude, I fucking forgot! Right? Isn't it? Who did I add today? Is that last episode? Did I forget about it last episode? Holy shit. I can't believe I forgot about that. It's not even on this episode. I completely forgot about that last episode, but I lost anyway, so you guys can't be mad. Ooh! I almost just went to kick off middle. Calling that timeout. On sidekick, baby. All right, let's just try, like, no power. Let's try that. No power inaccurate. Okay, at least it goes up the middle. Well, 15 to zero is not the worst start I have ever had in my whole life. Slip screen, slip screen, slip screen. I'm sorry, sir, but you're not going anywhere on this. T just summoned a demon. Play action, play action, do it, 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 do it. Lurk, 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 lurk. So either I just get shit on and play horrible, or I basically am gonna get a get a rage quit. That's kind of like how this is gone so far. Although I can't say this is gonna be a rage quit. Done. Although I think that would have been the icing on the cake. This is fourth and two. I'm gonna go three, three, five wide. So that way Hendrix is in the middle. We're gonna play underneath everything. I've got the middle locked up. In one big stop, right here. Going to the middle, going to the middle. Yeah. Yeah. He's gone. He's got a rage quit after this. Holy shit, before he quits, we need a Devonta Adams touchdown, bro. Look at Plump, dude. What are you doing? <laughs> no! I can't get my Devonta Adams touchdown! On the Devin White pick six, I could have gone out at the one and tried to get Devonta Adams. That might have been the smarter decision. All right, so first things first, I'm actually gonna do the challenge wheel. I only kicked on side kicks. Kind of nice when they rage quit. Gonna go Legends Fantasy, just kind of hoping for a left guard, center, or right guard here. Would be huge. Taylor Rapp, Damian Harris, Snell, yikes. They all like skilled. That was shitty on the first round. Very shitty. Ono's player, Deerdorf. There we already have you, heavyweight. Michael Pierce. I ain't taking Roger Craig. Michael Pierce ends up being pretty good. Also, I'm an idiot. When I lost that game, I took out Vita Vea, which was dumb. Vita Vea was not from that episode. I need to put Vita Vea back in as well as Michael Pierce now. We also keep Melvin Ingram. Defense is looking good. We're not in an 88 overall like we were before, but hey. We're in 84. We got Vita Vea, Michael Pierce down here, Melvin Ingram. Left end, outside linebacker, middle linebacker two, and then obviously still my offensive line. And then uh, we're in a sub position. Jake would play pretty good on his first game. Be pretty sick if we could lay the pipe for a Super Bowl. Come on, man. He's a plumber. He's literally a plumber. Could be sick. And I gotta, dude, I gotta start grinding on Devontae Adams. I am not doing what I need to do. All right, boys. I love you, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching. As always, peace.